Confidence is not an attitude we want to hide. Indeed, it's a feeling we want others to notice. The most obvious confidence gesture is direct and simple eye contact. When we're confident, we're unafraid. Steepling signals confidence too. That's when you put your fingertips together to form a church steeple. Depending on how high up from the lap this gesture is placed, we can tell just how confident the person feels. When it's placed just above the lap, this person's confidence can easily turn to self-doubt. When the hands are placed by the eyes so that you're looking at others through your fingers, you're feeling pretty smug. Be aware, though, that it provokes an uncomfortable and suspicious reaction in others because it looks like you're signaling that you've got something up your sleeve. You'll probably get a defensive attitude and gesture in return. When you see a hand in the jacket pocket from which only the straight-held thumb sticks out, that's a gesture of confidence. Hands laced behind the head is another sign of feeling sure of oneself. If, in addition, your legs are crossed too, again, you're feeling quite smug. That's no longer confidence, that's arrogance. And again, you can usually expect a negative response. The touching gestures of reassurance are open gestures you'll be glad to see in others. Unlike the more hostile touching gestures, which are quick and aggressive, these are calm and deliberate hand movements that are meant to reassure and calm us and to show affection. Acceptance, too, is an open reaction. It's often signaled by moving closer to the other person in a relaxed manner.